Okay, so um, my Shimano cleats have turned up today, uh, as you can see. One thing I could say about these is the colour isn't as bright as they look online. And obviously it's in Chinese writing, which I assume um, they could be originals. Uh, that could actually be Japanese, I'm not sure. Could be Korean, I don't um, But they're, they're just plastic cleats anyway, so there's not a lot to be to go wrong with them. Um, and this is me, Muddy Fox Shoes. Where oh, they're muddy is the right word. Um, I've got to give these a quick clean, and basically the cleats will fit on the bottom there. Like so um, I'll do that in a minute. Okay, so I took the old uh, screws out. You can see here. Um, they're in the bottom of the shoes. You can see they're on there. Um, these basically fit on the bottom of your shoe as so it's all good doing this while holding the camera obviously but we can sit it still for a minute alright there's an easy way of doing it we'll put them on the floor you got these brackets that, that come with it they all drop in three for each shoe like that. You can see a bit of play in them um, obviously just to line up on the shoes you got these um, the thing with these is you will need an allen key because they don't fit otherwise <laughs> um, but then you just drop that onto your shoe and then screw them down uh, where you want them Very simple, but as I say, I'm struggling to do it here with only um, one hand because I need to put that in there, then tighten it up with an Allen key. So I'll be back in a minute once I've done it. Okay, the first one's on. Um, it's pretty solid, but one of the things I did have a problem with is if you have a look at the original um, thread. Oh, sorry. This is the threads that come with it. The the ends are pretty thin, um, pretty short. Sorry, um, but you've got a lot of surface on the top. But the ones I took out that were originally in the shoes, the tops are very narrow, but the thread is about twice the length. Um, so what I had to do was I put one of the, the original ones in, the longer ones, to hold it in place while I put the other ones because it helped line them up. Um, as you can see there's a bit of adjustment in it. Um, that will be where you adjust the shoes for when you're on the bike. Because um, obviously there's a little bit of play in there. Um, and that's the first one on. I'll do the other one and that will be the shoes set up. Um, as you can see I've got a set of pedals which will be the next thing we set up um, but at the moment we're just clipping the shoes on but what you have with these is, is when you're wearing them on the bike it's sort of clip in um, and then you'll sort of twist to undo them to take your foot off so your feet aren't permanently stuck on the bike um, I'll show you in, the, in a minute on the pedals 